A resurgent Aston Villa trounced Premier League strugglers Nottingham Forest today. Prince William, one of Villa's most famous fans, was at Villa Park to see the emphatic 2-0 victory. William took along his son Prince George, as the father and son were spotted delighting in the resounding win. The Royals were seen jumping up and down celebrating the goals from Bertrand Traoré and Ollie Watkins. William was also spotted with his head in his hands as he watched on during an early first half of football. George appeared to mimic his father's reactions to the game. They even dressed very similarly, with both wearing pale blue shirts topped with navy jumpers. The win leaves Nottingham Forest in the relegation zone. However, Villa boss Sunai Emery has won 11 out of 17 games in charge. The crucial win means the club are just six points off fifth place Tottenham with eight games remaining. Father of three William has long been a fan of Aston Villa and regularly attends games when he gets the chance. The football-loving royal also serves as president of the Football Association. George has often joined William at football games in the past, watching England and Aston Villa play. William explained why he backed Villa during a 2015 interview on the BBC. He said, a long time ago at school I got into football big time. I was looking around for clubs. All my friends at school were either Man United fans or Chelsea fans. Don't miss. Kate broke royal rule after running late for Easter church service. Latest, Queen feared Harry's consumed love for Meghan clouded judgment. Latest, Meghan's curt three-word response that surprised the Queen. Latest, William continued. I didn't want to follow the run of the mill teams. I wanted to have a team that was more mid table that could give me more emotional roller coaster moments. While the two royals went home happy after the win, they will soon be busy getting ready for Easter Sunday tomorrow. It marks the first Easter Sunday where the royal family will be led by King Charles, following the death of the Queen last year. Sunday will also mark the second anniversary of the death of Prince Philip.